Rockwell Collins are here at PTE uh, showing our latest airport systems products. Our first product is our VMUSE mobile platform. This is our VMUSE standard VMUSE product that we have ported onto a tablet device such that it can be used for um, queue busting, irregular operations. Uh, the, the agent can then take it to the passenger wherever the passenger happens to be. It'll work both on-site and off-site, so we can take passengers to, air, to hotels, for example. It has all the functionality for multiple airline DCSs that a conventional Muse check-in desk would have. Uh, we have a thermal um, Bluetooth attached boarding pass printer. The bag tag print would be printed to a locally attached um, uh, check-in desk, conventional check-in desk. It's not really suitable for, for handling uh, multiple bag tag stocks, but otherwise you can do all the functions on a regular tablet device that you would otherwise do on a conventional Muse check-in desk. What we're showing here is our VMuse Enterprise platform, which is our standard VMuse product, but hosted from the cloud. Uh, but what we have is integrated biometric capture um, with, the, with the platform, such that we can do identity management through the entire airport process. In this case, we have uh, Aurora Infrared Facial Recognition Biometric Capture, and we match the facial biometric with the passenger's boarding pass details at the time of check-in. We can then reuse that uh, combination of boarding pass and, and facial image uh, biometric capture through the rest of the airport process. Here we have the same biometric device uh, integrated with our Veripax airside access control system. We validate the passenger's boarding pass along with their biometric to ensure it's the same person that we registered at the check-in desk and ensure their identity through the rest of the process. Simply scan the boarding pass and the camera validates the passenger's identity and once both match, the passenger is uh, allowed access to the airside area. This is the final stage of the process, the aircraft boarding gate, the self-boarding gate. Uh, the passenger presents their boarding pass to be scanned as they would do otherwise. The identity management system captures their facial biometric and once those two are validated, the passenger is authorised to board the aircraft. All conventional back-end systems, the host integration remains exactly the same. The airlines do not have to change any of their systems. Uh, we integrate the biometrics seamlessly through that airline DCS. This is our AirDB, our Airport Operational Database product. Uh, this is a database that is a central repository for all airport uh, data and information flow. This is our latest generation of the product that's installed at several airports. You can see the, the dashboards and the charts that we're able to display. Uh, but it's an operational tool, it's part of our operational suite, which includes our FIDS product, AirView, and our resource management system called AirPlan. Here we're demonstrating our AIM security platform. This is our integrated security platform for the airport, including all aspects of perimeter, staff access control and CCTV requirements for the airport. We integrate them all onto a video wall for the operations control center so they can monitor all aspects of security for the airport. Here we're featuring our ARINC managed services capabilities. This is service provision at the airport, so all the infrastructure that we provide can be managed by AMS from first and second level support calls to break fix maintenance and third level uh, technical support. This is our enterprise hub type B messaging solution. It allows the customer to process manual and automated system generated messaging all in one place. We can offer our customers a large cost saving due to the system creating a virtual LAN environment so that all intercompany messaging is free of charge. Mm -hmm.